Sheldon, am I glad you're back? Taking a turn for the worse. I think I'm gonna need another bath. <laughs> I'm surprised to hear that. The other day, I was concerned that you weren't recovering. So while you were sleeping, I took a cheek swab and had it cultured in the lab. Oh? I got the results back. Yeah, have you developed any of the following symptoms? Uh, growing nose, or perhaps a warm sensation in the trouser region, also known as full-blown liar, liar, pants on fire. All right, all right. But I really was sick at the beginning. It's just been so nice having you take care of me. It hurts that you would lie to me, Amy. I thought our relationship was based on trust and a mutual admiration that skews in my favor. <laughs> I feel terrible I did this. Well, it pains me to say it, but I think some form of penalty is in order so as to discourage this type of behavior in the future. I suppose that's fair. What do you suggest? In a perfect world, I'd lock you in a stockade in the public square. <laughs> that probably requires a permit. I could not be allowed to go to the opening of the next Star Trek movie. Oh, that seems overly harsh. <laughs> we gave into a human weakness. You can kill a man. <laughs> you know, it's a tad old school. But my father was not one to spare the rod when my brother would sneak into his truck and drink his driving whiskey. Are you saying you want to spank me? But I don't want to. But it looks like you left me no choice. That's true. In a very bad 